don't forget, Mutt owns the Fantasy Pros home run title for the past three years. My name is Mark Trumbo. I'm a bee. Throw me that fastball. Give me some heat. You a soft lefty. I'm a beast. Give me that fastball. It's in the seat. All together now. My name's Marma Trump. When I say Revis Island, you say, what is it, 2015? Revis is on the wrong end of a lot of jokes as he was beat for two bombs with no safety help so far this season. This week, the joke will be on Jerry Macklin and the Chiefs passing offense as Revis looks vintage as ever. The Jets' D-line is going to get to Alex Smith more often than not, and with Macklin no longer the deep threat he once was, Revis will waive his blackout day and be the number one corner we know he can be. If you own Macklin, do not pass go. Do not collect $200. Do not start the every week wide receiver too. J Mac is on a one way ticket to Revis Island and he is not coming back. He's a nine time fantasy champion qualifier. While it is nearly automatic, Mohamed Sanu has a big Monday night against the Saints as Matt Ryan continues to shred defenses for 300 plus yards. I know you all want to hear another sleeper beast wide receiver. Philip Dorsett is primed to have the biggest week of his NFL career. With Dante Moncrief not playing, the former first round pick is about to show the fantasy football world who the future number one wide receiver for Andrew Luck is. No fantasy expert ranked Dorsett higher this preseason than myself, and if you had any beast season package, I alerted all fantasy owners that he was must-own when he went undrafted in less than 50% of ESPN leagues. Dorsett is the future, he is more physical than Hilton, and this week Dorsett is a top 10 wide receiver. Want to see the rest of my picks? Sign up for a start, sit, or beast rankings package today. Beast.